All right, and we're back. And boy, do we have a great show for you today. That's not really how, how I usually do it. Oh, that's really nice. Look at the background there, like blooming trees. Very good. Well, let's go into fun world. We have some fun in the world. Oh, it's been a while. Am I out of practice? I don't know. I don't know for sure. Um, well, first off, I think I should do a couple of housekeeping tasks, so to speak. One is um, Minecraft related, and that's I have kind of, okay, it's dark out here. Let's see. Okay, so I guess if the moon sets there, I think the sun sets there as well. And I guess that is west. All right, so I've kind of tired sand and of this area and I've been thinking um, that I will set out across the ocean probably in this direction into the west I wonder if there is this, there probably is like some sort of mnemonic in English too but in Germany we have this kind of little thing about uh, the sun so I mean, it basically it just says like the sun rises in the east. It's at its highest point in the south, and it sets in the west, and in the north, it's you can never see it. Well, it makes sense, right? So I feel like if that is true, if I remember this correctly from my childhood, and Minecraft also adheres to that logic, uh, then. Pretty soon, I will set out to the west. I will, as they say, go west because life is peaceful there. I think that's the lyrics. I'm not sure. Ah, should listen to that song. Good. I like it. Okay, so that's my Minecraft update. I'm going to, over the, maybe even in this video, I'm not sure. I'm going to pack up a bunch of my treasured possessions. Maybe build a boat. I'll build a boat. And set out there. I don't know how far the ocean is. I mean, there's still a lot to do here, right? And I never attacked my nemesis, which uh, was always a sort of thing I was thinking about. They first attacked me, to be fair. But, uh, oh no. Oh, that's bad. That's not good. That's not good at all. Um, But yeah, so I was thinking of uh destroying them in in what could be deemed uh preemptive revenge <laughs> that is that is a good uh term terrible and good at the same time but yeah uh i think i will just leave this behind for now there's also still a big cave down there but i i want to go to more luscious lands and start over my Minecraft life. So that's that's thing number one. Thing number two in terms of housekeeping, as I call it, is more about the videos themselves, not about Minecraft. And what I want to do... Okay, so there's two aspects to this. First, um, so far I've usually aimed for 20-minute videos in terms of like the topic is about 20 minutes long, then I would stop, um, upload that video, maybe maybe I'd record another one, but I think the 20 minutes is, it's just a bit too much. I hope you don't hear too much background noise. There's like, my, my Sarah, that's my, my Sarah is eating her breakfast, so there might be a little bit of dangling and stuff. She's going to listen to this, so. I'm gonna call I'm calling her out right now. Being called out. Oh no, she can hear it right now. Okay. Ah wow, what did I do? I didn't even notice. I wasn't looking. And now it's all this. And there's a zombie. Okay, so hopefully not too much background noise. And if there is, you know, that's just that's just the way it goes. 
um yeah about recording so i'm thinking i'll aim probably still at like more than 10 minutes per video but more well however long it takes for a topic I'm, I'm going to be a bit more free going to lower that barrier of entry for myself and just uh, record more freely um this is kind of monstrous i'm just like letting him run and the sun is going to rise over there we can see it actually it's beautiful you know and he's going to burn up just like um what's that girl's name in in the vampire uh in in, in, in into you with the vampire it, it, antonia antonette forget I read that a couple of years ago I feel like my memory should be better but yeah anyways so he's oh no it's a sand one i forgot he's not gonna burn to a crisp this is this is a massive miscalculation on my part this is just going to go on forever and ever and ever i'll just run in circles and he's going to follow me and the sun will never ever release me or him from his torment oh massive miscalculation would have been kind of cool though right like if he just like you know bursts into flames as he's chasing me yeah look they're bursting into flames but nothing with him well okay miscalculations happen okay point two about the videos um let me just get my thoughts so point one was uh probably only like up to 10 minutes well up to it could still be 20 minutes but uh i'll i'll tr more aim for like a minimum of 10 minutes maybe even less sometimes and the second thing is i i want to start doing a couple mm, of like minor edits sometimes this will take a little bit more of time and it'll kind of raise that uh barrier i was talking about so maybe we'll see how whether i actually do it but i'm kind of thinking of like doing a little intro and when i talk about something maybe putting up some photos things like that because one of the as aspects of why i'm doing this is i wanted to get better at editing anyways yeah so those are the two housekeeping tasks that's already we're we're at almost eight minutes I mean, we did that little chase with the, the zombie. It was pretty fun. Uh, makes a lot of sense. Let's see. Uh, what do I have to have wood somewhere? Yeah, I have my wood in here. Um, the topic I actually wanted to talk about in this video is uh, my skin removal surgery. I think I talked about this previously in the videos. I don't know. They're kind of like... Um, they don't stay in my mind as well as one would uh, hope for a mind to recall things. You get me. Um, so I'm not 100% sure whether I talked about it. So, so I'm, I'm just going to set it up. Yeah, basically I lost a lot of weight and uh, I was thinking about maybe having a skin removal surgery. In Germany and I actually I talked to a doctor and had already planned it for September and what I want to talk about is mostly why I'm not doing it although so to to set that up uh, what I was going to do was actually is probably going to be two surgeries one was like the chest surgery um, which I'm more I'm more self-conscious about the chest because I guess you know it's kind of interesting like i talk a little bit about trans issues sometimes but this is it's sort of it is gender affirming care in a way because i want a chest that's more masculine basically and and i'm, I'm kind of self-conscious about it it's kind of interesting i'm not like uh, transgender but uh, obviously this is an aspect of uh, gender identity that also for cis people like myself uh, can can be relevant the second surgery would have been a stomach surgery, which is, I think, more more common. A lot of people who lose a lot of weight, they do want to get rid of the um, the excess skin they have around their belly. Um, often because it uh, gives them trouble. It doesn't really give me much trouble at this point. So um, it's it's more cosmetic for me. But possibly if I if I want to do more performance 
uh, based things like running, it, it might become a problem for me too. It's hard to say at this point. Uh, let's see, let's see. Um, so yeah, the reason why I'm not doing it, the main reason is because I'm just not near my goal weight. I actually, I gained, yeah, I gained some weight over from the last year to this year. I'm about 10 kilos over what I was before. I was 115 kilos, which I felt pretty good with. And now I'm at 125 and I'm trying to get down again. But, uh, I, th I think it's just a bit of a waste if I'm at much higher my ultimate goal weight would be like something like 105 and being at 125 or even 129 as I was at times um, just doesn't, like it doesn't really make sense to do a big surgery at that point because the, the result won't be as good as I want it to be. It won't be, um, it might not stick as well, you know, and things might, become uh be, be, get worse again so i'm I'm just thinking it's, it doesn't make sense for, based on that alone i also was kind of like i was a bit worried about doing it you know it's kind of a scary um scary operation and i wasn't like a hundred percent i went back and forth between should i do it should i not do it and i mean on that basis too if you're if you're kind of going to do such a massive surgery i do think you probably should be pretty <laughs> pretty convinced of it um so that's that's also why i'm delaying it at least for now I, i'm not saying i will never do it but um yeah I'm, I, I, I was set to do it in september and that's that's definitely not gonna happen i'm not uh i'm not i already canceled that so that, that's basically what i wanted to to say in terms of the skin surgery um, it's a bit sad. I, w I was going to see my, my family, obviously, but on the other hand, we were in Europe just for a month and, uh, I, I've kind of like, I grew tired of Europe by, <laughs> by the end of it. I have to say, I, I'm, I'm really happy to be back home and, um, <laughs> So I, I don't really want to travel anyways. Um, it's not That's not really the main factor or really a factor for why I, I chose not to do the operation at this point, but it's it's also coincides with it. Let's see, I'll take some sand too, I think, because um, I might not have as much sand, sand in a different biome. Let's see. I'm happy with this. Iron, iron, iron. Is there anything? Do I want to take clawberries? Maybe. I think I'm going to quickly make um, a bunch of bread. Let's see. Can I do it like this? Oh, here we go. This is what I need. Why can I not make... Oh, I don't have... Ah, that makes sense. Um, yeah, yeah, I get it. I think I just need more of this. And then I should be able to make a boat. Okay, there we go, there we go. Yep. Boat. Thank you. Mm, oh, this garbage I can get rid of. Why, why would I need this? This is good, this is good. Now, red. Yeah, so I mean, it, I think this worked out in terms of length. Like, I didn't even talk that much about the the skin removal search. I was just kind of giving an update. I, like I said, I don't remember whether I, um, I even talked about it before. But if I did, it makes sense to give an update. And if I didn't, yeah, I also want to talk about it. That's good. Where do I get my bread? Where do I make? Ah, here we go. I'm just gonna make everything into bread. Like it doesn't go bad, I think. So might ah, uh, might as well just have the bread. Okay, there we go. It's almost completely full. Yeah, I think I'll just spend the rest of this video um going through all of my boxes, and this is just nothing. 
useful here. Sugar, do I need sugar? Not really. Not really, not really. Mm, I mean, I have some space slip, I might take that. No, no, no. Uh, that reminds me of something I also have to go before I set out, which I'll probably do in the next one then. Lint, lapis lazuli. I don't need any of that. Wonder if there's anything where I'll be like, oh no, really should have, really should have taken that. Ah, uh, yeah, so what I wanted to do before, is there something in here? No, a bow, do I need a bow? No, stone sword. Sword, no. Um, I wanted to say, pay my respects to the rabbit we lost, that I, I caused the death of somewhat um, inadvertently. So I wanted to say goodbye to the shrine I have built for the rabbit. Uh, before I set out, um, pay my respects. So I did that. So basically, I think I can actually go. I'll take this bed. That's a good to bring. Let's see. Let's see. Yeah, I'm fine with that. Um, I will leave. Let's see. Sun is going down. Do I go through the night? I think I will. Okay, so I'll leave it at at this point. I'm going to save and quit, and I'm going to just record another video. This The next video is going to be about a completely different topic, so you can be excited about this, not knowing what it is. And I'll see you in the next one. And stay spooky, friends. That's what I say. I forgot. <laughs> Almost. Bye-bye.